So Microsoft released their new update for Copilot in which they have completely redesigned their interface, provided lots of features in which the best one is a very interactive human-like sounding AI assistant. Hi Mohammed, what's on your mind tonight? So yeah, without further ado, let's explore this new update of Microsoft Copilot and see all of the cool features that it offers in its new update. Alright guys, so first of all, if you are wondering how you can go ahead and get the new uh, latest Copilot in your PC, so that's really simple. So first of all, you need to go ahead and head to your Microsoft Store in your Windows. And in the home screen of a Microsoft Store, you need to go ahead and search for Copilot. And it's going to basically go ahead and pop up the Microsoft Copilot app for you. So from here, you can easily go ahead and install this. And once it's installed, so this would be a, the kind of a interface that you'll get after signing in with your Outlook or Hotmail or Microsoft account in your Microsoft Copilot. All right. So this is basically would be uh, the interface right over here. So first of all, in the home page of the new Copilot, uh, you can go ahead and get access to different settings. So you can change the voice uh, of your AI assistant or you can change the language as well. And then you can go ahead and change the theme into day or night. And the last one, you can go ahead and put your feedback or just, you know, get more information about the new Copilot Pro, right? Then there comes this uh, new Copilot home screen in which we have different sections right over here. So first of all, we have the new Copilot daily section, right? So over here, you can get access to different news, like it can be AI or on any other topic. So yeah, let's just say this is uh, the Gen X retirement uh, challenges and more. And the best part about this is you can go ahead and listen to the live news as well. Like take a look at this one's your Copilot Daily for Friday, October 25th. And this is how the Copilot Daily live news is going to sound. It's Friday, October 25th, and you're listening to the Copilot Daily. Here's a fun fact. Did you know that honeybees can recognize human faces? Let's get started with today's news. All right, so that was pretty interesting. Next up, you can go ahead and just play around with different uh, topics that you can search with Copilot. Let's just say if you want to search for plant safety for pets, so you just need to click on that and it's going to basically provide you with the entire prom, like live house plants that are safe for common pets such as dogs and cats, include any plants that may offer health benefits to pets. So yeah, it's going to give you a complete overview on that topic and yeah, it will be really, really accurate, you guys. Then you can search on uh, like bartending skills or, you know, you can interact with anything you like with this new Copilot Pro, right? So similarly, there is a very new innovative way of interaction uh, with the new Copilot Pro. So yeah, what you can do is you can click on this mic button and it's going to get you interacted uh, with a very amazing human sounding AI chat ball. Like, take a look at this. Hi, Mohammed. What's on your mind tonight? All right, so from here, I can basically go ahead and give any topic, uh, like I can talk with any style uh, with the new Copilot Pro. So let's just say I say to Copilot Pro that, so basically I'm working on a YouTube channel for my audience and I want to give instructions to my audience that how you can go ahead and grow your uh, YouTube channel. So can you help me with that, please? Absolutely. Here's a few powerful tips. First, consistency is key. Set a posting schedule and stick to it. Viewers love knowing when to expect new content. Second, content is king. Always aim for quality. Research what your audience is interested in and tailor your videos accordingly. And third, engage, respond to comments, ask for feedback mm -hmm. and build. All right, so that sounded pretty good as you guys saw, right? So yeah, you can go ahead and just interact with the new AI chatbot of Copilot. So yeah, what's amazing about this is you can go ahead and talk with it in a very human style. So let's just say I interact with Copilot in a more human-like style. So I say, hey, Copilot, how's everything going at your end? Flowing along smoothly here. How about for you? What's new in your world? Nothing much. I'm just working on a few projects right now. I'm just trying to, you know, just make content for uh, people all around the globe. Nice. Creating content is powerful work. What kind of projects? All right, so you guys saw like that was really, really beautiful, right? And you know what's the best part about is uh, whatever conversation you're going to go ahead and get uh, with Copilot Pro, so that's going to be auto-generated in the form of prong box. So yeah, these are a few things I talked uh, with Copilot Pro. So yeah, we can go ahead and get access to that. So that will come into your Copilot Pro prong box as a text conversation, okay? 
All right, so another cool options you can get uh, with the new AI chatbot of Copilot is if you can go ahead and go to this setting options, it's going to give you four uh, different voices uh, or different genders. So you can select between male or female. So right now I have selected Wave. That is my absolutely favorite, but you can also go ahead and select Meadow. Let's explore the world together. You can also select Canyon. Philosophical, creative, or poetic. Or you can select Gru. As a companion, I learn about you. Which sounds uh, pretty interesting as well, you guys see, right? All right, so these were uh, pretty cool features you get now with the new latest Copilot Pro. So let's just go ahead and test out some of the Copilot capabilities, like how you can go ahead and perform different tasks with the help of new Copilot Pro. So first of all, we're going to go ahead and test this out with a bit of AI image generation, right? So yeah. Copilot Pro is a really nice tool for creating quick images. So let's just say I go ahead and type in my simple prompt over here that create me a realistic portrait uh, of a woman sitting in an Italian cafe. And if I click on submit message, so yeah, right away, it's going to go ahead and start working on my image. So it says, got it, your image is on the way. And it's only going to take around like few seconds to generate a very quick image for you. So yeah, take a look at this one. So from here, I can download my image. So if I go ahead and open this, so yeah, this is how our image looks like, which is not as realistic as we wanted. But yeah, the idea is there. There is a woman sitting in an Italian cafe. So yeah, uh, according to my testing, uh, this Copilot Pro is very good in creating cartoonish images. So let's just say I provide uh, another prompt like, Create me a cartoon image of Harry Potter and let's just go ahead and submit this. So yeah, just like that, it's going to go ahead and create that animated cartoony image of Harry Potter right over there. So yeah, it's holding a wand. So yeah, that looks really, really good. Let's just go ahead and open this. So yeah, if you want to go ahead and create like cartoon characters, maybe cartoony images, fantasy images. So yeah, Copilot could be a really good choice for you in that case, right? So let's just say another very cool uh, productivity you can go ahead and do with Copilot Pro is you can create images of your project. So let's just say I go ahead and type, uh, first of all, the prompt is going to be create me a project proposal of making money with AI. So let's just say if I click uh, submit, so yeah, straight away is going to basically create the project proposal for me, which will include introduction, objective, scope, and all those important things that should be there in my uh, project proposal, right? So from here, let's just say I want to go ahead and create image uh, like with the description so I can simply type in my prompt like create me an image based on that description, right? So straight away, it's going to go ahead and create the image for me uh, with reference to making money with AI. So yeah, this is how our image is going to look like. like. Take a look at this, right? So yeah, we have an AI generated robo in the middle and everybody is working on different things like they are absolutely running a business and making money with the help of AI. So yeah, this is how you can go ahead and add different images to your uh, project proposals to your presentation in order to make it more and more engaging. So for that particular task, Copilot could be a really wonderful choice for you guys as well, okay? So let's just go ahead and now test out some of the coding capabilities of Copilot. So yeah, first of all, let's just go ahead and generate some simple code. So I'm gonna type generate me a Python code for factorization of a number, okay? So yeah, straight away uh, with just few seconds, it's gonna create a very simple Python code for me. So yeah, that was a very simple task of how you can go ahead and create like, you know, you can generate codes with Copilot Pro as well. So let's just say, similarly, I give it a more complex task. So this time I'm gonna say generate me a complete Python snake game, right? It's going to go ahead and generate that for me very, very easily as well. So now we have a very complex, long Python code of snake game with all the important libraries like pie game, time and random. So yeah, this is a complete long code. And you can basically go ahead and generate as long codes as you want with the help of uh, the new Copilot Pro as well, okay? So there you go, guys. This was a complete tutorial of the new features of Copilot Pro. So yeah, I hope you like this video, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.